fuck off! All right, where the fuck is this thing? If you guys get any more ugly, I'm gonna have to start killing you blindfolded. For me? Shit. Fuck off! We hate it when they do that. Up thugs with their faces so ugly, stomping on demons who want all that snugly, shooting at nightmares that fly with their wings. These are a few of my favorite things.
Oh, hey, you guys. You need directions? Just take a sharp left through my sword and keep on going. Mushi Haker may be a cold-blooded sociopathic mob boss, but she knows how to decorate. Hello? Hello? Jeez, is this a party or was there a toxic spill? Perhaps you will realize her destiny one day. Fascinating. Get your chance. I see. There has been an incident, Mr. Wang. Smith, what are you doing here? You work for this beat? Nice lady, too? I am in no one's employ but my own. You two know each other? Smith is my mechanic. Fixed my car a few dozen times. I am here on personal business. Comico has gone missing. The birthday girl. Does that mean no Kate? It's gonna mean no balls for you if you don't shut your yammering mouth. Ah, oh, I see what's going on. The big boss's daughter got lost on your watch. Do I smell a beheading? More importantly, do you think they'll sell tickets? I'm afraid the situation is quite serious. For some time, she's been worried that Zilla has found her out. And today she was due at my garage at four. She is never late. <laughs> whoa, 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 rewind. Zilla? Orochizilla? Yes. She was working in his labs. Undercover. Oh, he doesn't like that kind of thing. I'm organizing a rescue mission. Zilla's security is legendary. They wouldn't get past the front desk. And what would you suggest? Go in quiet. You send one guy. Preferably one that knows his way around. Are you offering your services? Depends on what you're paying. One hundred thousand. Cash. Ah. That should please my accountant. I still have a few old badges and a couple fakes. I can get in and at least tell you what you're dealing with. Go then, find out what happened. Bring her back if you can. Back here? No. This is the first place they'll look. Take her to... I have a secluded location you may use. Okay then, take her to the old man's place. Bring her to my garage, I'll meet you there. What do you want me to do with this? I can give it to her, when I see her. Lo Wang. Yes. Don't fuck this up. If she dies, they'll be picking your fingertips out of my gardens for weeks. Lady sure knows how to motivate her workforce. Intimidation is the tool of the fearful heart. Hey, it beats being the fool of the tearful fart. That's deeply stupid. But it's true. Fair enough. Get out of here! Feel like a goddamn babysitter. 
But you know what? Babysitters make good money. Welcome to the shiny, happy future. Hey, <laughs> one out of three ain't bad. It's just so hard to find a good forger these days. Access denied. Note to self, kill your fucking forger. Killing you guys is wrong. I don't want to be right. Future just keeps getting futurier. Ah, room's locked. Bulletproof glass, too. I wonder if that's. Ah, oh, Kamiko. My star pupil. Yeah, of course it's her. Come now, come now, calm yourself, my dear. Let you go? I'm afraid I can't do that, my dearest. It would spoil our grand experiment, and you always loved experiments. Before we embark on this grand adventure, there's something I should say. I am deeply in your debt, young lady. I would never have achieved all that I have without your help. The lab just won't be the same without you. To steal from. <coughs> Proceed. God damn it, Zilla. I knew you were into some twisted shit. This is on a whole other level. That's strange. What's happening? 
Is she all right? Someone check her vitals. Pulse is normal, sir. Untie her gag. I don't want her suffocating. We need her to be... Flies carry on the stench of death. Oh my. Now this is getting interesting. Aw, oh, shit. Bulldoze bodies. Open sores. Dismember children. Secure the room. I need to examine her in person. I'm on my way. Yes, sir. Hey, you guys know a good Mexican place around here? What? Get him! Together, man.
like this is in your millennium. Zero. One. One. Hey, spooky number lady. I'm gonna get you out of here. I just need you to... I am the graveyard of hope. I am the end of all times. I am the shadow of the world. In Boshina. God damn, girl. To what thou wilt shall be the whole of the law. I am the filth under your nails. I am the oil that stains your soul. I am despair made manifest. Okay, so this is probably a terrible idea, but I'm sort of out of options here. Uh, I'm gonna untie you. When I do, please don't eat my face. I'm a friend, okay? Friend! <laughs> All right, here we go. And my face remains uneaten. Gonna put that one in the plus column. Up you go. Come on. Take it easy there. You're doing really well with the non-face eating. Now. Where's the emergency exit? Fuck! Zilla, this place is a fire hazard if I've ever seen... Oh, hello, ladies! What's that? You're trapped in a glass box? Oh, that's good. How many years did you spend in mime school? <laughs> Listen, I would love to stay and catch up, but I've got this possessed girl and she's... You see what I mean? <laughs> Kids today, right? Smith! Kamiko! What happened? I shot her up with some kind of serum, and she went... like this. Follow me quickly. Through here. I hope I can trust you. Whoa. What is this place? This is my... other workshop. Holy pieces of sacks of shit! Where did you get all these swords? I made them. They are my family's trade. But there is no time to explain. Lay her down here. Okay. There. Now, wait here for a moment. Wait here? Oh, not a problem. I'll just hang out here while Linda Blair pukes blood out of her eyeballs. I know, I know, I don't like it any more than you do. Can I, uh, go now? Unless we act quickly, she will die. Who's this we, white man? Excuse me? Okay, okay. What, what do you need me to do? I need a place for her to stay. I have a futon she can sleep on. It's also my couch, but it's clean. But shit, you have this place. Why can't she just stay here? I need a soul she can co-locate with. You need a... Her body has been corrupted. If I do not separate her soul from it in the next few minutes, it will become corrupted as well, and she will be gone forever. That is pretty fucked up. Once her soul is removed, we can fix her body. Then she can re-enter it. But in the meantime, I need a place to keep it. Her soul. Seriously. I did something like this once before, and it did not end well. In truth, you are my only option. Well, keep it in your soul, then. I can't. I'm performing the ritual. Oh, there's rules. That's convenient. She's too far gone. I have to start. I'm not getting paid enough for this shit. I am the Night's Mirror. What are you doing to her, old man? I'm the devouring soul in the world. Shit, it's blood across the sky. Are you ready? Ready? Ready for what? Hello? <sighs> Who is that? It's me. Um, Kamiko? The girl from Zilla Labs. Yeah. The one I rescued? I'm not sure. I don't remember much. Where are you? I don't know. Where are you? I'm not sure. Everything got so loud, and it all went black. Well, have you tried opening your eyes? It actually hadn't occurred to me. Are you okay? Smith! I'm fine. I just... Where am I? Kamiko, are you okay? She's all right. She just told you. Wait, this is the weirdest... Is this my body? Wait, are these my fingers? Wait, who's talking? I didn't hear anything. In my head, I keep hearing... In your head? Am I... Can you hear me? Is she... Okay. I think it worked. 
Comical soul has been temporarily placed in your care. Are you, you serious? Serious? It's really rather miraculous. That's not the word I would have chosen. I'm riding shotgun with this dimwit. Do you understand, Kamiko? Everything is going to be all right. Oh, <laughs> right, sure. I mean, this day's been fantastic so far. I lost my job, and then my boss tried to kill me, and now I'm stuck inside the head of some wannabe ninja! She's great. How long do we have to do this for? Strange. I'm in here, seeing through your eyes, but I'm also asleep back in Smith's dojo. I can feel myself with my eyes closed. I wonder if I can... <clears throat> Wiggle my... Don't pull a muscle. <clears throat> Ugh! Would it kill you to let me concentrate for a second? You think it's easy sharing your mind with someone? I don't think I can move my body at all. Just so long as you can move mine. Yes, sir, Captain Krusty, sir. At ease, soldier. So you, Hideo? Master Wang! It is a pleasure to meet you. I've heard a lot about you. <laughs> All good, I hope. Uh, it's a pleasure to meet you. Fucking kids. Hey, what's going on, Hideo? The usual. Training. Vigilance. I've taken over the Kung Fu sessions for Master Smith while he works on a cure for Kamiko. Nice. Sounds like fun. It's work. We have to be ready at any moment. For what, exactly? Justice never rests. Well, you're a serious young fellow. I'd say you remind me of me, except you're about as far from me as humanly possible. Thank you, sir. I'm not sure how to take that. Master Smith asked me to show you some of the chi techniques we have developed here. With your training, they should be elementary. Fire away. I'm always up for new and better ways to fuck shit up. Lo Wang, how are things with your new roommate? Oh, you know, it's great as long as she keeps her mouth shut. I have to ride around in this cesspool of your mind all day and not talk about it? I wish I had skin so I could crawl out of it! You pompous, oversexed idiot! She agrees. Mm, I very much doubt that. Please, treat her with respect and kindness, Lo Wang. She is very dear to me. Oh look, someone with manners! Shocking! I'm sure you two will find a way to put aside your differences in the name of the greater good. If by greater good you mean me getting my money, then I heartily agree. 
Money is an illusion used to hypnotize small minds. But it sure helps when you're trying to buy a bottle of good whiskey. Ugh. I need four things. First, a demonic rod. Then the skin of a large mammal. And some raw chi crystals. They can usually be found near black brain pools. Careful, though. The pools are what seems to be causing the mutations in the animals out there. Maybe I'll pick up some dinner while I'm at it. I would not recommend eating them. I'm doomed. I will also need golden chrysanthemum. The vendors in the marketplace usually have them. Wow, crystals and flowers. Hey, dudes, we going to harmonize our resonances and use them to levitate the Pentagon? <laughs> Something like that. Come on, the sooner I have these materials, the sooner I can get Kamiko back where she belongs. All right, all right, back in a jiff. Larry, how's it hanging? You know this guy? Old friend. You always make me smile, Lo Wang. No, wait, that's not it. You always make me fart. That's what it was. <laughs> that hurts, Larry. You know, you're a real demon, you know that? That's what my mama always told me. What can I do for you? I actually have a very special request today. I need a golden chrysanthemum. Ooh, specialty item. Very hard to find. Come on now, Larry. I know you're holding, and you owe me one. It's a fair cup. Yakas a mess with you anymore? They still give me dirty looks from time to time, but there hasn't been an incident since you put the fear of Wang in them. I did do that, didn't I? And I do owe you one. Here, on me. Bring your wallet next time. Okay. Hey, thanks for this. Thank you. You saved my business, maybe my life. Hey, let's not get weepy about it. I don't want you to start spitting acid everywhere. Racist! Demon! Big kiss! Ew. That demon's name is... Larry? Well, his real name is unpronounceable. He wanted something his customers could relate to. And he chose Larry? Yeah, said he saw it in a video game. Nerds. Look who's talking, Dorcas. Car, sweet car. Is this our only transportation option? Why, you got a better idea? Sorry, I'm just used to... What? Teleporting? Actually, you're not far off. What? I figured it out when I was training with Smith. It was an accident. You accidentally teleported. When I calm my mind, I can see these statues. And if I focus on one, it sort of pulls me to it. In the real world? How? I have no idea how it works, but I've been doing it for the past year. <sighs> no wonder Smith took an interest in you. Here, close your eyes. I'll show you. Shh. Be very, very quiet. I'm hunting dickheads.
It's not whiskey, but it'll do. Son of a bitch!
yourself together, man. Refreshing. is in your millennium.
You got... <clears throat> Wang speaking. Has Kamiko's condition improved? Like she cares. Not exactly, but we're working on it. And are you integral to her recovery? I... Uh, I'm not sure it... Good, come to my office. I have something I need done. Will it involve getting paid this... You know, she's a treasure. Lo Wang, I didn't expect you back so soon. Funny how efficient you can be when there's someone in your head yelling at you all the time. Do you have a problem with efficiency? So you and Kamiko are getting along then? I wouldn't call it getting along so much as getting through. Enough chatting, let's get on with it. The rock doesn't choose the river, nor the river the rock, yet neither would exist without the other. Tell him to lay off the cryptic wisdom and make my stupid potion already. Kamiko says you're full of shit. Oh, I doubt that very much. Okay, she said to lay off the cryptic wisdom and make the stupid potion already. That's my girl. My items, please. Here you go. Oh, and hey, Kamiko had a question. What was that thing her dad got her? It is a spirit well. An extremely powerful artifact. Uh, say what now? It is like a container. Only it can hold a person's soul. Wait, seriously? Why can't I live in there instead of with this idiot? She wants to know why you didn't put her in there. It would not be a good idea. Once you have entered a spirit well, you will never emerge. Oh, so it's like a Comic-Con. This is a complex operation. It's going to take me some time. Check back with me when you can. The cure is coming along nicely, but it needs more time to cook. In the meantime, do you think you could help me with something? Does it involve moving a piano or coming to an open mic night? It does not. Then I'm in. I'm running out of crude. And crude is? Unrefined, Unrefined black, black rain. rain. The, raw, the material raw material that comes, that out, of comes the ground. out of the ground. She's, uh, she's telling me. I'm oh, sorry. that's right. I Forgot didn't mean about to your tiny things. mind. Hey, seriously, you guys have to stop that. All right, what is this stuff for? It's, it's the, the unrefined, unrefined material that... Just let him talk! Excuse me? Sheesh, somebody woke up on the wrong side of the collision. Sorry, I'm still getting used to this. Sludge is the base. It can be fractionally distilled into a variety of things. Fuel, lubricant, even liquor. I need it to run my forge. There's some wildcatters out west of here in the wilderness. They'll sell you some. Just make sure you ask nicely. I am, in all things, a model of gentility. Well, they weren't refining fuel out here. No wonder they blew themselves up. What do you mean? They were trying to make black whiskey. Hey, we all need to take the edge off now and then. Right. Tell me about that when you go blind drinking something your buddy mixed up in an outhouse. Hey, Pete's getting blown up. Looks like these guys are good guys. Well, I think we should head back. Uh-uh, no way. We need to get Smith some crude. You know, Sula has an operation out here, too. I've never seen it, but it can't be far from here. And they're just gonna lend us a cup of sludge? You may need to convince them. Ah, I can be very persuasive. You mess with the bull, you get the way.
Whoa. I'd heard people do this out in the wilderness, but I never quite believed it. What? Just go out in the woods and dig for crude. How else are they supposed to get it? You should see Zilla's operations. Clean, efficient, safe. This? This is like playing tag in a uranium mine. If you love Zilla so much, why don't you marry him? He's a great scientist. Yeah, so was Oppenheimer. What's the weather like up your butt? Oh, fucking die, you ugly son of a bitch! Nothing like it! Just take this. I found your pals in the forest. Give him the crude. What about them? They were playing a little fast and loose out there. Give him the crude! What did you expect on the frontier? Let's just say you could fit what's left of them into a decorative vase. Will you just go? Oh, well then I'm gonna have to think about uh, how to source some more. Just relax, old man. I got you covered. You are such a... Arr! Call me old man again, and I'll cut your wang off. I read you loud and clear, sir. Come see me again if you find yourself at loose ends. Hey, I've been meaning to ask you about these swords. 
Yes. You say you made these? These are Tamagahane steel. You don't just make Tamagahane steel blades. You don't, but I do. I apprenticed for 20 years, and each sword takes me around six months. You spent two decades learning this? That was a quick study. How did you find a master sword maker willing to take you on, given your, uh, you know... My non-traditional skin color? Yeah. I learned from my grandfather. He was a traditionalist, but was able to overlook my background, given the complexity of our family history. Do tell. My grandfather was the last surviving member of the Masamuni clan. Is that so? And let me guess, your uncle was Kaiser Soze? Believe what you want. I am who I am. Ha! Ah, I've heard that one before. I think it was, uh, Yahweh. Or was it Popeye? I always get those two mixed up. Your disbelief is reasonable. My family was a living ghost story. They forged the Nobitsura Kage. If you believe that sort of thing. Believe it. Brother, I own it. Now, who is telling tall tales? No, oh, I got it right here. But it's not what it used to be. No? I used it to... kill a god. After I did that, it began shrinking. See? Fascinating. Does it have the powers from the stories? It did. Little hard to wield now, though. Unless you're Mighty Mouse. What if I told you I could fix it? I'd say that's the third most unbelievable thing you've said during this conversation. Let's see... Oh, dear. I don't have the correct scrolls here. They're in my grandfather's library. If you retrieve them, I will see what I can do. Oh, don't worry. Fetch is my favorite game. I'm not telling you how to live your life. If you're in the neighborhood, check it out. Or don't. Whatever you say. Enjoying your vacation, Mr. Wang? Oh, it's going all right. I could use another Mai Tai and some sunblock, though. Well, if you can rouse yourself from your leisure, I have further use for your skills. What's going on? Some assholes are cooking up back alley shade in the slums. Oh, that's horrifying. I need you to put a stop to it. For the, uh, children? <laughs> no. To show them that no one sells shade in my territory without getting his balls shoved down his throat. I think I can handle that. I need you to figure out what that little shit was working on. She sent regular reports, but I think she was holding out on me. Uh, of course I was holding out on you, you evil bitch. What's so funny? Ah, uh, nothing. Private joke. I need you to go to her apartment in the city and bring me anything you can find that looks like science. Notebooks, lab equipment... Sounds like it requires a lot of initiative. Listen, you cocky piece of shit. I hired you to protect a very expensive piece of merchandise. You brought her back broken. Until she's fixed, your ass belongs to me! If I say I want a human bird feeder, you start shoving crumbs up your ass! Uh, that's... colorful. I'm just used to jobs that require more chopping and less hauling. Oh, you'll get your chance. Zilla's gonna have her place staked out with some serious muscle. Damn. I mean, wonderful. Have fun, you miserable piece of shit. Love you too, sweetie. She is a charmer, huh? Sometimes I fantasize about her being slowly eaten alive by ants. It's comforting. <laughs> Remind me to stock up on borax. Take my eye! Oh! 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 
small, but efficient. You are know where I can get some shade? I'm partial to oak trees myself. <laughs> Cut the shit. I know you're selling. All right. How much you need? Uh, four hundred? Shit. You serious? I only got dimes. You want more than that? You gotta talk to the chef. The chef? The guy who cooks the stuff. That's what he calls himself. And where can I find him? He doesn't really like visitors. Look, I got a lot of cash on me. I'll make it worth his while. All right. Tell you what. You head down that alley, and I'll tell him to come see you. Cool? All right, cool. See? That's how a master does it. Oh my gosh, I am so impressed. You're like really young and hip and streetwise. Can it. I need to focus. <laughs> so, which one of you guys is the chef? Hand over the cash, or we cave in your fucking skull. <sighs> I should warn you, this is a terrible idea. Shithead! Long time no set me up! You wanna end up like your fucking friends? Uh, I'm sorry. I thought... You thought you'd tell me where the chef actually fucking is now? Uh, yeah. He's up that way. Don't tell him I told you, okay? He's gotten real... weird lately. Yeah, I think you have bigger things to worry about. Like, say, never running into me ever a fucking again. <laughs> that sounds reasonable. Hey, I'm nothing if not accommodating.
yourself together, man. Hello, new ammo friends. You ready to kill some people? The Ten Crack Commandments? Number four, I know you've heard this before. Never get high on your own supply, huh? Mr. Wang, I trust you have good news for me. That depends on your perspective. What is that supposed to mean? Well, his next of kin probably aren't thrilled. The local vultures are delighted, though. Wait, is that some sort of idiotic way of telling me you killed him? Ah, uh, yeah. I thought it was pretty o You goddamn moron! I told you to deliver a message, not slice him up. I didn't want him dead, I wanted him on my fucking payroll! I'm not so sure about that. He was pretty far gone. Don't tell me my business! If I want someone killed, I'll say so! Why didn't you tell her about Biggie? Shut up. You lucky asshole. Nothing like the fresh. 
yourself together, man. really do look alike. No ammo, friends. You ready to kill some people? Feel lucky, dipshit?
demon guts in the morning. I love the smell of demon guts in the morning. Looks like someone's been through here before us. Wow, they really did a number on this place. Looter's gonna loot. At least we got this diary. Consolation prize for the old man. Guess you're not getting your sword back after all. Oh, I'm getting it back. But the instructions... Were stolen. All I have to do is steal them back. How can we find who took them? Well, we can start by tracking down whoever put these tags. Huh. Smart. Yeah, I'm trying to keep my intelligent movements for you. Get ready for a tsunami of stupid. I'm afraid there's not much left of your grandfather's library. It is unfortunate. That's it? You lose a trove of priceless, irreplaceable documents, and it's unfortunate? Who can say what is good luck and what is bad? I try to remain unattached to any single outcome. Wow. I bet you're fun in Vegas. Anyway, there was a particular piece of graffiti all over the place. I think it might be connected to the looters. I will have my students do some digging. I thought you weren't attached to any one outcome. My fist will be attached to your face in a moment if you continue being impertinent. Understood. Let me know if you find any leads, sir. Any luck finding the looters? One of my students contacted me briefly to say he was on to something. But we were cut off. And he hasn't checked in since? I'm afraid not. I would appreciate it if you could try to find him. He said he was on a rooftop overlooking the marketplace. This is my way. Wait a
Hey, kid. Lo Wang, I'm so happy you're here. That makes one of us. The fuck happened? I am ashamed to say that I failed. My pride made me overbold and I was captured. How can I get the key to this thing? That guard there has it. But be careful he does not raise the alarm. together, man. Lucky Mary? Hideo, come in. Yes, Master Wang? I found your lost sheep. Ah, uh, excellent. I'll be over to collect him shortly. Hey, be careful. Still a little rough around here. I will take the necessary precautions. Thank you, Master Wang. Master Wang? I could get used to that. Okay, kid. You heard him. He'll come get you soon.
My student told me everything you did, Lo Wang. Thank you. Everything? Everything. I should be able to repair the damage you did to his training within uh, two years. Hey, um, I didn't mean to offend. I can be a, a dickhead sometimes. We all have our own path. You are not called to the silence. To pursue it would be folly. This, um, way of the Wang you spoke to him about? The way of the Wang is long and hard and ribbed for her pleasure. I see. Well, good luck with that. Kill some fuck faces. Lucky Mary?
yourself together, man. This is in your week. like a fresh clip. Where's the stuff we need? Oh, I don't keep any of that here. First place they'd look. What are you talking about? We spent all this time breaking in here, I got blood all over my shirt. Why would we- I really wanted a cup of tea. You wanted a- I like tea, okay? Wait, you have tea here? Where the hell did you get tea? Zilla knows a guy. It's one of the perks. Can you put the kettle on? Look, I don't think we have time for that. Where are your notes? If I tell you, will you make me a cup of tea? No! Tired of this shit. I'm not your personal valet. Now where are your stupid notes? I gave them to Zing for safekeeping. Zing? 
Like, head in a box, Zing? You know someone else named Zing? He's the only person with any honor in Zilla's organization. Person might be stretching it, but you make a fair point. Wait, you know him? We met once, a long time ago, before he was on TV. I never expected him to go work for Zilla. Hey, you did it. I did it. We all make our choices. Guess so. Let's go see the big lug. What about my tea? No time now. At least bring it with you. Maybe Zing will have a kettle. Oh, and we should bring my keycard. Sure. Otherwise, how will they know we're visiting? You think I'm an idiot? This is the card I hacked. Full access, full anonymity. Okay. That is impressive. And pioneering Chi Tech isn't? I can't win with you. Hmm. You shouldn't try. Like this isn't your day. This isn't your money.
Wow, wow, wow. If it isn't my favorite corporate shill. Hello, Wang. How wonderful! I haven't seen you in ages. My goodness, you seem chipper. You'd be amazed what access to total media surveillance will do. Destroy your faith in humanity? Exactly! It's really quite amusing. It's like reality TV, only, you know, real. How did you get in here? Oh, I had a word with the guards. Sorry, I always mess that up. I had a sword with the guards. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds like the old Lo Wang. Does Zilla know about this? Now, this is strictly on the QT. I'm actually here for a friend, a, um, a Miss Kamiko. Kamiko? How is she? I was worried about her the last time we chatted. She seemed nervous. Tell him I'm fine. She's okay. Been through a rough patch, but hanging in there. She sent me to get her notebooks. Well, now this is awkward. She gave me very specific instructions not to give them to anyone. Come on, Zing! You know me! My point exactly! How do I know you're really here on her behalf and not just trying to sell her research to the highest bidder? Because, uh, because... Okay, this is gonna sound silly, but... She's actually inside my head. Come again? Her... <laughs> body got corrupted and her soul was sick? I, I don't really understand it, to tell you the truth. All I know is she's in here. That is ridiculous. Yes, it is ridiculous. It would make a wonderful TV show, though. I think so. If it were true, which it can't be. Tell him I have to miss 4 o'clock club today. She wants me to tell you she's going to miss 4 o'clock club today. She... The... My word. What the fuck is Four O'Clock Club? Kamiko used to come by every Friday at four. We drink tea and watch... Jackie Chan movies. How that is adorable. You've proved your point. The drives have tracking chips in them. I'll send you the chip IDs that will tell you where to find them. See, you're the best. I wish you had a body right now so I could hug it. You mean the one you chopped up and tossed off a cliff? Um, yeah, that's the one. Yeah, I gotta tell ya, I'm not sure I'm in the market for hugs right now. Fair enough. Nothing like it! Zilla shitty. I, I mean city. No, I mean shitty.
Whoa, whoa, hold it, hold it. Do not give her that one. Why not? That one has my actual research in it. And the rest of these are just idle doodling? Hmm, worth about as much. In this business, you can't be too careful. There's always someone trying to steal your work. Um, yeah, about that. You know I'm only doing this because... <sighs> it's fine. Just make sure you give her the fakes. And what about this one? That one, we destroy. I don't even want to think about what would happen if that fell into the wrong hands. She may look stupid. Hey! But she knows how to write fancy. Is this everything? I brought everything that wasn't nailed down. I think one of them might even be her dream journal. I hope not. I don't want to know what that thing dreams. Probably of money, like everyone else. Speaking of which... Of course. Your fabulous booty. But be ready. I may need you again soon. <laughs> I'll see if I can fit you into my schedule. Have another job for you. Awesome. Am I working another birthday? The last one went so well. I need you to gather intelligence. Oh, but you and intelligence don't appear to be on speaking terms. Oh, zing. Very cute. What do you need, Mom? We're trying to find the source of the black ooze that's permeating the wildlands. We believe it may be coming from one particular area. And that area is? It doesn't have a name. I'm sending you coordinates now. <sighs> I can't wait. Good luck, Mr. Wang. Any news about our friends? Word on the street is everything they got has already been sold off. Shit. To only about four different vendors. This is a small town. And you can find them? They're not exactly in hiding, sir. Point me in the right direction. I'll take care of the rest. First guy I'd try is Saito, not far from here. If he has them, I'm sure you can persuade him to sell them back to you. Oh, I can persuade him, all right. I'm just not sure any money will change hands. Thank you, I appreciate it.
Hey, you Saito? Who wants to know? Ah, just a humble art collector. You don't look like an art collector. And you don't look like you're about to be a pile of tiny pieces. Still, here we are, right? What do you want? I want those scrolls you have. Oh, uh, oh, um, I, I sold those already. Bunch of junk. Who the fuck you sell them to? I never divulge information about my clients. And I never divulge information about where I bury my victims. Uh, let me up. Let me show you on your map. <laughs> Wise choice. You'll need a password to get in the door. It's 23 Skidoo. Much obliged, Saito. Lucky chump. Hear about the receptionist job? Password. Ah, uh, 23 Skidoo. I believe you have something that belongs to a friend of mine. Everything here used to belong to someone else. Now it belongs to me. Oh shit. What about my ass? Does that belong to you too? It will by the time we're finished here. Quite the contrary. It is you who will belong to my ass. You gotta work on that one. Yeah, that didn't come out as cool as I thought it would. Uh, kill you anyway? Though I very much doubt it. Do you ever not kill everything? <laughs> Please do not tell me what you do with your own time. That hurts! I'll teach you a lesson. Looks like.
like this isn't your day. Wang, you have done my family a great service. No more than your family has done for me. Perhaps. Still, I am in your debt. Now, let's see what we can do with that sword. Careful, you don't want to slice off a fingernail. Remarkable. I have never seen anything like this. All right, I will attempt to restore it. Please, stand back. <laughs> You ruined it even more! Under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. This sword will never enjoy its former glory. But now, you can put it to work inside another sword. Ah, uh, well, that's something, I guess. killed today.
I've killed today. Holy Nelly birds, what the fuck? What do you think it is? Oh, I know exactly what it is. Those are the outer gates. This must be where they emerged into our world after the collision. And shit, look at this. You know what this is? Nope, but I have a feeling you're going to... Mezu's armor, after I knocked it off him like a little bitch. Who's Mezu? Oh, just a god whose ass I kicked. No big deal. Ooh, do I get to hear another story about how awesome you are? I were super awesome at until his ass exploded? Something like that. Long time, no ass kicking. Oh, no way. Have you come by to gloat at my meager circumstances? Well, it wasn't my original plan, but now that I'm here, why not? It'll be like old times. I'm not sure why I thought I'd get sympathy from you. Some naive thought that you would grow up one day. Yeah, 
Keep dreaming. Looks like your old stomping ground poked through into our world. How's it feel to be on my turf? I have tried to accept the situation with as much dignity as I can muster. <laughs> hey, zero is a start. Why are you still hanging around here? I am tasked with guarding the gates. The collision did not change that fact. I was sent to find out where the ooze is coming from. Looks like you have a little seepage problem there. If certain parties have not taken it upon themselves to disturb the gates, we should not be in this predicament in the first place. Oh, you mean my brilliant strategy to distract you while I kicked your ass? You don't comprehend the forces you're dealing with. If it were not for me, the gates would have opened that day. Humanity would have perished if not for my sacrifice. All oh, right, you're secretly a good guy. Slip my mind. seal them again, I attacked him. It was some serious battle feature of organization. It's a fine line between brilliant and cowardly. Hey, a win is a win. He was trying to kill me. Do you ever wonder about the fact that you're the hero of all the stories you tell? I mean, come on. How likely is it that you are always... Uh, sorry, I gotta take this. <sighs> Loang, please return here with all haste. Zillisbin are invading the village. I believe they're looking for chemical. Your assistance would be appreciated. Damn. I'll be right there. We have to get back there. Now. No shit, lady. Teleport us already. Okay, just let me get a lock on... Oh. That's weird. I can't... I can't feel the statues in town. It's like they're not there. Doesn't matter. Just get us anywhere close. Okay. Nearest spot is... Um... It's gonna be a hike. Out of the possible, lady. Out of the possible. Whoa. That is a lot of soldiers. When was the last time you saw him give up on his Oh, sorry I messed up your plan. Don't worry. 
worry. From the looks of this, I won't be your problem much longer. From your lips to my eyes. This isn't your day. You ready to kill some fuck faces? If they made it this far, they're probably all the way into Smith's inner sanctum. Hurry! Hey, I can get us there quickly, or I can get us there alive. Quality mate. Hideo! What's happening? Zilla's men were heavily armed, but we fought them off. Unfortunately, Master Smith was gravely wounded. No, no. Gravely? Ah, uh, was Zilla's men? Go to him. Quickly. He says it is important. I must go and guard the entrance. Stay alive, Hideo. That is the idea, sir.
Hello? Kamiko! Anybody home? Oh. You okay? I don't... Oh... It was like... It was like being stabbed by a thousand fiery knives. Oh, shit. Was it the same stuff they shot you up with before? I think so. What's your body doing now? My body? My body. My body, I can't feel it. I can't feel it at all. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, thanks for the update, Captain Obvious. Oh, no. This could be a problem. Ah, good to see you. Both of you. What happened? Kamiko's body went and mutated and broke free. It was... it was raging. Incoherent. It came after me, but... I couldn't bring myself to harm her. Wait! I killed him?! Try not to move. I'll get help. The Yakuza must have some. <laughs> I have tried. This wound is imbued with some sort of dark potency I'm helpless to resist much longer. Indeed, I... I believe I have reached the... the end of my road. No! Smith! He can't hear you. Then let me speak through you! I don't know. Listen. There is... there is something we must do. The cure is complete. I... <coughs> Fetch me the flask from the... <coughs> from the library. Hello, young ones. This is an auspicious moment. I have completed my final meditation. Let me talk to him. What do we need to do with the flask? Keep it safe until you can find a way to administer it to Kamiko's body. It will heal her. Then you will need a chi bender to reverse the soul binding. <laughs> Ritual. I need to talk to him now! I'm a chi bender. You cannot perform it on yourself. Let me guess. I'll go blind? Your soul will discorporate and become a wisp, a drift in the ether. I don't think you'd like it. Oh, you mean like... Will you let me talk? Okay, okay, Smith. Kamiko wants to speak with you. I'm not really sure how this is going to... Smith? Smith? Whoa. Like that, I guess. Yes, child. You can't die. I'm afraid you are mistaken. You, you showed, showed me that I was, was worth something. something. And that, that I could fight to become something, something more. more. I only saw what was already there. <coughs> it is a rare occurrence when one person can truly help another. That is the gift you <coughs> have given me. What, what will I do, I do without you? you? What you would have done with me. Leave here. Become yourself. Save the world, most likely. Do not shrink from greatness, child. Breathe into it. Become it. You need not find your path. It has been beneath your feet all the time. Now, to the amulet. A spirit well. well. But... Wait. wait! There is no more waiting for me. In this way, I can remain on your path a few moments longer. I will always love you. And I you, my child. As for you, Lo Wang. Yeah? Look after my students, if you can. Easy on the dick jokes, okay? Shit. I hope I have the strength to go out like that when my time comes. You... You jerk! Me? What did I do? He wasted his last words on you! I prefer to be the mistake. Is that me? Either that or someone hid Bigfoot's Pozak prescription.
nothing like a fresh clip. Insults, lady. Let's not forget who's driving this bus. Oh, believe me, I remember. Okay, so let's just. An idiot! Okay, let's go. Where? Anywhere but here. Too long. It has been too long. Hermiona? Is that you? What you see is but a reflection. I am in my temple. Hey, listen, I'd love to catch up, but I kind of have the entire world up my ass right now. Can we, um... Come. Take refuge with us. We will succor you. Excuse me? It is the least I can do for my brother's dear companion. Actually, that sounds pretty good right about now. It is settled then. Look for me between my mountains. In the valley where the sun does not shine. Farewell for now. Dude. What? Her. I knew she was an idiot from the papers, but that gave me full-body douche chills. You don't have a body. Details. She's a freak. And she was hitting on you. So, we have a little history. I don't see what choice we have. She's offering us refuge. She's offering us a one-way ticket to Creeperville. Good thing you're not driving. <laughs> well, I'll be, if it isn't my old pal Fuckface. Amiona says you're to come inside. What, no metal detector? Guess you don't need those when you're immortal. You are on sacred ground. I would appreciate it if you could respect that. And I would appreciate it if you choked on a peanut. We all have different struggles. Come on, open up. Is it me you're looking for? Lo Wang, it's been too long. Freak show. Oh, uh, hello. Let me guess. You've worn out your welcome with yet another employer. 
You know me, another day, another pink slip. They, um, <laughs> what was it they used to say? Can't, uh, handle the wang? <laughs> yeah, something like that, yes. Well, here on the mountain, we can definitely handle the wang. <laughs> Please know that you can stay here as long as you need to rest, recuperate, and plan your next move. Well, thank you. It's, uh, very much appreciated. There is actually one thing I think you can do for me. Name it. This is gonna sound weird. I very much doubt you can surprise me. Okay, um... I have a young girl trapped inside my head. Oh, I'm so glad you said something. Are you actively transitioning? Have you told the important people in your life? No, uh, no, it, it's not... No, no, I understand. These things can be hard to talk about. No, it's more of a, a, a magical situation. <laughs> oh, wonderful! I'm so happy you're at peace with it, darling. No, I, I rescued a girl. and She was mutated in one of Zilla's experiments. In order to save her, a, a Chi Master placed her soul in mine while he fixed her body. Oh, how fascinating! Not really. He was killed, and now she's stuck. I was wondering if you could put her soul back if we were able to locate her body. My darling... Oh, <laughs> sorry, darlings. I would be delighted to help you. Transitions like these deserve to be marked with care. I'm touched you would ask me. Oh, wonderful. Who is this girl? Oh, um, she's the daughter of the Yakuza's big boss. I see. So you have taken something precious to them. Believe me, I'd give her back if I could. You two don't get along? Oh, no, no, she's really, really wonderful. Don't get me wrong. But yeah, I want her the fuck out of my head. Where is her body now? Yeah, so that's the thing. It sort of mutated into this giant monster beast thing and, um, ran away. Oh, Blow Wang. You do get yourself into the most marvelous scrapes. Everyone has a talent. Well, we are simple folk up here on the mountain and do not invite adventure. I won't be able to help you get the body back, but if you can retrieve it and return it to its original form, I can sort out her soul for you. Excellent. Oh, and if you find yourself with time on your hands, speak with Gozu. He has been getting overwhelmed with his duties and may need some help. Overwhelmed by duty? <laughs> that sounds like Gozu. I'll check it out. Well, you certainly sound eager to get rid of me. Oh no, not at all. You should think about redecorating in there. Maybe get some curtains, push the place up a bit, you know, really make it your own. There is one thing I will need in order to perform the soul-joining ritual. And that is? Ancestral Chi. Oh, great. I'll just pick some up from the Piggly Wiggly. Ancestral Chi is coded to each individual person and carried in the spirit of their families. I need a close relative. Or a body part. Hey, no problem. I'll go hack off her grandmother's arm. Hmm, grandmother. No, not enough power. It needs to be a parent or a sibling. Hmm. She's an only child, and her mom's dead. Hmm, then you're looking for her father, I suppose. And how the fuck are we supposed to find him? Bring me something of his, and I may be able to help you. What, like one of his old playboys? Oh, a magazine would work. Clothing is better. A weapon is best. If you can manage it. Wonderful. We'll get right on that. So, any idea where your dad is? No, but I do know who does. My dear darling Mima. Mamushi Heka. You know... You're not as stupid as they say. She's not going to tell us anything, you know. Oh, she'll never tell us anything. But she carries something of his wherever she goes. His wakizashi. Why does she have his... He gave it to her, to mark her as his favorite. It bears his chop, and as far as I can tell, she never parts with it. So she won't mind if we borrow it for a tick? I think she'd stab out your eyes if you looked at it too long. You know, some people probably find that off-putting. But I love how direct she is. If it isn't the poster child for Prozac. We 
are supposed to be allies now. Oh, come on. You're an immortal being. Aren't you even gonna try to smite me? We have a problem. Amiona has requested your assistance. What could be wrong up here on the mountain? Aren't you guys are walking around with rainbows and unicorns pouring out of your asses? It's not what's up here that's the problem. Some of our number have gone missing. Wait, let me get this straight. There were people who actually chose to stay the hell away from you? Who in their right mind would do such a thing? Laugh all you want, but this is serious. After going to town for supplies, several of our people never returned. Something foul is afoot. Now let me guess, you want me to check it out? Amiona believes the Yakuza may be responsible. And she'd send you, but you just whine them to death. <laughs> I'll take a look around. You wanted to see me, Eeyore? Uh, I don't know what to do. Oh no, did you run out of adult diapers again? We have completely exhausted our supply of tea. I'm gonna go ahead and file that under Uptown Problems. Do you have any idea how much that stuff costs these days? Amiona takes her tea every day at four. It simply cannot be missed. Okay, where do you usually get it? We have tea plantations deep in the wildlands. But we have not had a shipment for days. I fear something terrible has happened. Well, you're involved, so it's already pretty bad. Without tea, the goddess becomes... upset. All right, all right, I'll check it out. But just for the record, this is the least gangster thing I have ever done. Thank you, Lo Wang. Your generosity will be remembered for generations. Just like your body odor. <laughs>